So you've um, set up your email address in Outlook and you would like to set up your email signature. I'm going to show you a simple step-by-step -step example on how to set up a signature that not only looks great, but it works every time. So first of all, what you need to do is uh, click on file, go to options, click on mail, and then on signatures. So over here, you want to create a new signature, give the signature a name. All right, then head over to a website called mail-signatures.com. Um, the reason why I use this service is because the default Outlook formatting tools is basic and you won't be able to create an awesome signature. So over here, what you would like to do is you would like to choose your template. Uh, we're going to go for this, this green one. All right. Then what we're going to do is we're going to fill in all the names, the job title, the email address, the phone number, etc. And then we're going to head over to graphics. And this is where we're going to put our logo in. So you'll see this is a URL to a, an existing logo. So you would want to change this to the URL path where your logo has been uploaded. Now you can either get this from your current website uh, viewing the source and checking where exactly it's loading the, your logo from or you can simply go to your cPanel account and basically upload your logo so we're gonna go to file manager we're gonna load it in the public underscore HTML directory and we're just gonna upload the logo there all right so basically what I would like to do now is I would just like to change the link and basically change the link to your website address. In this case, it will be this one I'm using here, eSite Maker. So now head over to style and uh, change your font colors and your font style. And then also put in your social media links. Uh, click on the apply signature now what you would like to do now is is to copy signature to the clipboard pressing this button here and then head over to your outlook again and uh, inside here hold control and press v to paste And then basically set this up so that when you send new messages from this email address or you reply, it's going to use this new email signature you've created. All right, so we can go ahead and test it now. So yeah, so it's working fine. So you can see as it is working fine now. And uh, yeah, that's all there is to it.